Eh, 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 this is your fault. All these wigs are your fault. I just want you to know. Public service announcement to Ehi. This is the monster that you created. Yep. Yep, I'm airing you. Let everybody know. Welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Ifoma. And today we're going to be talking about wigs. This is the first human hair wig I ever bought. And I try to cut bangs in her. Let me. I try to cut bangs in her. And this is what happened. They're all like right here. So needless to say, it was a disaster. So I decided to turn her into a full lock wig. And it's coming. It's coming along rather nicely. Um, it was inspired by Rihanna. You know, those like huge locks that Rihanna had that one time. But I didn't buy enough hair. So. Ahaha. <laughs> I'm definitely not the poster child for taking care of your wigs. My wigs are literally just in this black bag. So, um, we're gonna go through the bag today and try shit on, try stuff on, and see what needs to go and what can stay. And I named all my wigs, so we're gonna go through their names. This is currently my oldest wig. Her name is Melody. Um, she looks raggedy. From years and years of cutting and styling and pineapples I will usually wear this in a pineapple I don't feel like doing that right now um, but she's cute and she's served me well for the past six five years I've had this wig a long time I should throw this wig away I really should but will I we'll see find out next time um, yeah, this is Melody. She's cute, but whatever. I like her. I've cut her many times, and still there managed to be pieces that are too long in my face. Sure. And the back is too short. So I decided I would show you guys the plain wig and also how I style it. So this is how I would wear this. I usually wear it when I want a like messy, I just got out of bed but I'm still cute like romantic kind of look and here we go this is Nia her name is Nia Long damn she hasn't been down from that ponytail in a minute and I did try to cut some bangs into it and I failed which is why I always wear it in an updo sorry that I'm looking here I'm looking at myself because of course I'm looking at myself um but yeah, so filled with the bangs. But I love her. She's really cute, really fluffy, really curly. Um, yeah, and this is Nia Long. This is Shalissa, okay? This is Beyonce's wig's goddaughter uh, from the synthetic side of the family. This is, I think, I'm pretty sure this is my favorite wig. She's... Well, she's been through hell at this point. Um, I got this wig last year, I want to say. Last year, two years ago. So I combed out the curls. And now I just keep it like a wavy mess, you know. She's a lot. And then sometimes I'll brush her out. And she'll like get big and stuff. But we don't need that right now. She's the cousin who comes to the cookout and is on the phone with her boyfriend talking shit about everyone the entire time. Loud as hell. Shalissa said, You see how much work this is? Braiding this girl. I have to do this every time. I'm about to take her off my head. Otherwise, she will become a tangled fucking mess. We don't subscribe to that, not in this household. That's Shalissa. This is a new wig I just got. I have not been able to successfully style. Don't know what's going on. I tried like once in the middle of the night at like 4 a.m. So let's, I'm not gonna sit here and act like, you know, I tried really hard to style this wig and I failed. Um, I 
haven't named her. I don't know what to name her. Drop a comment down below of what I should name this wig. I don't know. She's supposed to be curly or wa wavy. Wavy, I guess. I don't know. This is like a loose wave. I haven't washed it or anything. So, this is Sarah. She, I got her for my sister-in-law in December. Um, she makes me feel like I don't have a forehead, so I don't really wear her. Um, yeah, she's cute. I like the color. I like the curl. I bullied Terry into curling it for me before she gave it to me. So I haven't even been able to wash it because I'm scared of losing the curls or waves or whatever. Um, Cause I can't do this shit. Yes, I can, but I just don't want to. Um, but yeah, this is Sarah. She's never been worn, so we don't know her very well. I feel like this is very everyday appropriate. If I like styled it, which I haven't done, one of these days I'll style her and then maybe she'll be great. This is giving whip wash. This is Melanie St. Clair and that's it. That's all I have to say here. This is like most people's favorite wig in my collection. Like this is the wig that everyone's like. Oh yeah, remember that hair that you have? I love it. This is Auntie Ruth. She is long. She used to be 30 inches, no more. She's really full and this is also one of my oldest wigs. I bought it in like 2016, I wanna say. Um, and <sighs> this wig has tried for me. This wig has tried for me. I've curled her. I've straightened her. Well, it's a straight wig. Here we are living our best lives with Auntie Ruth because she has achieved elder status. This is Velma Van Hurst. She's cute. She's a bob. I don't have many bang wigs. Mostly because I try to do them myself and I fail. This wig makes my face look really, really really round but I love her look at that body look at that movement look at that movement stiff well stiff well she's Valma this is Helen Helen Giacomo I don't know how to say her last name it's Italian she has spoken to many managers in her day. I love this wig. I don't, I should wear this wig more often, but I feel like it's very, like it's a statement wig, you know? Like you gotta have a fit to go with her. And she loves to get in my eyes. That's why I don't like this wig. It's always, always, always in my eyes. Always. Like fight me, Helen, goddamn, fight me. Just kidding, she's cute. This is the oh, bougiest oh, bitch I have ever me. fucking met. What do you mean, bruh? Do you know anyone who is this cute? Do you? I forgot how much I loved her. I forgot how much I loved her. There's ugh. always wants to be that one strand in my goddamn eye trying to blind me. But besides that, this is one of my cutest wigs. And it's not, she's not that new either. It's not that new. Um, but it's in great condition. God knows how. I had my mom ship me one of her wigs so I could be Madam CJ Walker in a presentation. So, this is Madam CJ Walker. That's, that's it, that's the tweet. <laughs> This, this is Shadi. Shadi is the newest member of my wig collection. Now, Shadi did not come here to play or to mince words or to talk to you. Shadi is here 
to make money. Shade is here to Shade is here for vibes. Synthetic oil. She said I'm giving you bundles. She said I'm giving you scalp. I'm fully 179% obsessed with this wig. Her name is Shadi. Shadi from Shadi's band. Sweet as taboo. If I didn't name her Shadi, I'd have named her Naomi. But Naomi is an Ngwekini Loki. No offense to Queen Naomi. But once Auntie Rona leaves, once Auntie Rona steps off our neck, then Shadi will take her place with her foot. On all of our mics, was it? That's what Shade is here to do. Shade is here to apply prayer, just a small bit of prayer. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, thank you for staying till the end of the video. Hope you enjoyed it. Um, hope you enjoyed seeing me act a fool and having fun with all my wigs that are in this black bag. Um, yeah, some of them will no longer be with us. They have to be put down. But it's fine because we have new bundles or whatever. <laughs> but yeah, guys, hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Share this video. Um, if you don't have if you don't have YouTube accounts, open a Gmail account, make a YouTube account and subscribe to this channel. I'm not here for jokes. I'm not here for jokes. Please help me, help my life, help my family. Hey, hey Joe. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Bye, guys. You know what's irritating? I specifically brought on my mascara so that I could put it on before I started filming. Guess who hasn't had mascara on this whole time? If you see my lace, mind your business, okay? Mind your business.